A comfortable retirement seems to be a long shot for some. Generation X say they will need around 1.1 million to retire, but are only on track to save around 661,000. That's according to a new survey from Schroders. And they aren't the only ones. Yahoo Finance's Kerry Hannon joins us with the details. Kerry, why are we like this? Oh my goodness, you just want to say sigh, right? You know, this is, you know, it's the, the issue of this big gap is it's concerning. It really is because the oldest Gen Xers are about 10 years out from retirement. So the door is starting or traditional retirement. You know me, I like saying people could keep working longer and longer, but that's a good thing. But the fact is what's happening here is number one, they're not planning for retirement. Like nearly half of them say that they haven't even started to actually plan for retirement. This is this is not good. Studies repeatedly show that when people pay attention to planning, they actually save more. The second piece that's happening is a lot of it, um, they say when they ask them what percentage they had in cash of the retirement funds they do have, 30% was in cash uh, cash uh, equivalents. And so this is something, this is not good for the long term when you're talking about growth in a retirement savings plan. Even the S&P 500 index fund is what you need with even a 10% pop over an average of 20 years, say, but they need to be getting a little more aggressive. So they say, why are you in cash so much? Well, they are in cash, Gen Xers are saying, because they're afraid of losing their money and they actually don't know where to invest. And this is a problem of financial literacy. And we hammer on this all the time. Time. The fact that they haven't really they don't understand where they should be investing. So this is an issue that's facing a lot of Americans now that this generation in particular is the first one to have 401ks as their primary retirement vehicle. And, and it is up to them to figure out how to invest it. So it can be a bit daunting. So that's one problem. Gen Xers also are feeling a lot of stress. They're carrying a lot of debt. They often have aging parents and children they're supporting, which makes coming up with the money, scraping it together to put into retirement accounts even more difficult. So these are just a couple of stumbling blocks this generation is facing. Now, the good news is uh, starting in next year in, in 2024, there's some changes in the retirement atmosphere and the in the world of retirement, thanks to some new laws that are going to be helpful, uh, we hope, over the long term. Uh, employers are now going to be able to make it easier for people to set up emergency funds kind of attached to their retirement plans. It's also there. There's a vehicle that's going to make it easier to tap into your retirement savings accounts on a moderate way, a thousand dollars or so to help people uh, not have to pay the, the penalty, the 10 percent of taking it out before 59 and a half. This is good news because it keeps people from raiding their retirement accounts. And, and this might be an opportunity to get in and even they can have a payment plan to return it. So they may not even pay tax on that. And then other thing is people who have uh, laid over, over um, education funds from their 529 plans that weren't used, they're now gonna be able to roll those in, into a Roth IRA, which is really a great thing. Uh, there are some lots of limitations around here. So you'll have to check up on the laws. But the final thing is the new legislation uh, the new laws going into effect in January are going to make it easier for employers to start um, starter 401k plans. So for small companies that don't have uh, employer provided plans for their workers, they're, they're, hopefully this is going to be an easier way for them to get set up a plan for their employers. And I got to say, Rochelle, 50% of Americans do not have employer provided retirement plans. And if you don't have that kind of plan, it's super hard to get started saving on your own.